With the SPI 120V inputs wired to the PED heads walk and don't walk terminals, the output voltage across the two rightmost terminals should be 12V DC at all times. Set your multimeter to measure DC voltage, and place the leads on those two terminals as shown. It should display roughly 12 volts, regardless of what interval the walk cycle is in. Now we need to measure the walk and don't walk output terminals. During don't walk, the voltage across the walk terminal and the common terminal should be 0 volts as shown. The voltage across the don't walk terminal and the common terminal should also be 0 volts as shown. During walk, the voltage across the walk terminal and the common terminal should be 12 volts as shown. The voltage across the don't walk terminal and the common terminal should also be 12 volts as shown. When lit, the red LED indicates that the PED head is in the don't walk interval, and that the SPI is getting 120 volts on the don't walk input line. Similarly, the green LED indicates that the PED head is in the walk interval, and that the SPI is getting 120 volts on the walk input line. Neither LED is an indication of any low voltage output on the SPI.